Well, so LIGO put out a request for electromagnetic partners, and Marcelli saw the request and thought it would be natural for the DE CAM to do this. We could follow up gravitational wave sources just by imaging the sky. That's what the DE CAM does so well. That was a very hectic long day. It started uh, before sunrise um, when the alert uh, was issued. And uh, it was clearly an exciting event. We knew it was a neutron star merger and we knew we had a chance of, of viewing it, but we had to get our act together to actually make the measurements. Suddenly I had all of the uh, devices in my home uh, basically ringing at the same time. Dylan Brute was in Philadelphia. I was in Tucson. Marcelli was in Fermilab. So we got together to figure out what would be the optimal observing strategy. And together we were trying to make the maps that that let you point the telescope. LIGO tells you it's over there. It's sort of literally over there. It's the bar, that part of the sky, about that wide on the sky. And you have to find out where the DE cam, which is about that big on the sky, where you, you point to cover the entire area in order to find one faint fuzzy blob. Also determine who would be the observers that would be on site and remotely performing the observations. So we had to evaluate all of that make the maps, make the files, and get it to the telescope all before sunset. And you would think you do this once. In reality, you do it three or four or five times until you get it right. And the sun is always setting. There is a deadline, and they cannot, you cannot go past the deadline. And at the same time, staging the images for processing using the grid resources at Fermilab. That was also triggered at the same time. So it was a, a very long, very long day where uh, lots of uh, pieces had to come in together. So we were out there looking through the space, looking for all the things that look new, and looking for something that's new and blue or new and red, and detecting it. And for us, for our team, as among as others, it was just the act of taking the picture, looking at it before and after, and saying, there it is. We have discovered something. 